Hi, Alan Hankster's Daytona. Big block Chevelle, 1970. 396, 350 horse style engine. Edelbrock manifold, dual feed Holly carburetor. Vacuum secondaries, real nice for a street with the automatic. Power steering, power brakes, new plug wires. H HID distributor, nice set of small tube headers on it for lots of torque. New water pump, new alternator, all new belts and hoses, four pass radiator, fan shrouds, real nice condition, real clean underneath the hood. Got a really nice looking 396, 350 horse style engine for the Chevelle. Very nice engine. Well, we're back with our 1970 SS style Chevelle convertible, big block car, Kyle induction style hood. Tuxedo black and white, ready for a night out on the town. Gorgeous looking car. Nice paint on the car. Gaps are very nice and clean. Chrome on the front bumper, it looks to be original in very nice condition yet. Basils around the lights, the chrome is very nice on. The grill is in excellent condition, not chipped or broken anywhere. Nice finish on the uh, grill, the SS style emblem in the center. Wood pins, nice the way they should be. Again, the gaps on this side is nice. Headlight basils all fit nice. Headlights around is nice. Really nice looking car in the front. All right, going down the driver's side of the car, the wheel lip moldings are nice, no dents or dings in them. <coughs> SS style wheels on them. BFG radials, white letter. SS 396 emblems are nice and clean. Chrome on them is very, very nice. Chrome on the rear view mirror is nice. Correct wiper blades and arms on it. Tinted windshield. Trim around the windows is very nice. The windshield itself is very nice. No uh, chips or marks or scuffs on it anywhere. Fuzzies on the doors are very clean and nice. Door gaps are real nice on the car. Fitment of the door is very straight. Going down the quarter panels, the trim around the convertible top is nice. A new white convertible top on the car also. Trim around the uh, rear wheel wells, nice again. No dings or marks or anything. Back part of the quarters, everything lines up very straight down the sides. When you look down the side of the car, it looks like it has no doors. It's very nice straight fitment. Very nice looking car down the sides. Going around the back of the car, uh, the trunk, as you can see, fits very straight. The gaps are excellent on the trunk. Flat as can be. Very nice. It's like a freshly chromed rear bumper on it. No marks or scuffs on it. Original tail light, basils and lights in it, correct exhaust tips for an SS 1970 car, SS uh, fascia across the back is nice, Chevrolet emblem is nice, no chrome peeling or pits or anything on it, very very nice. As you look down the sides of the car you can see the quarter panels and doors and fender everything lines up straight as an arrow on the car. Same thing on this side, the SS wheels, center caps, and uh, trim rings are all very, very nice condition. Doors on this side the same as the other. Nice and solid, straight, closes well, fits well. Nice straight car down the sides. All the trim around the window on this side, same way. SS 396 badges again. Just a real straight car down the side. You can't find one much straighter than this. Ready for the summer fun. All dressed up in tuxedo, white and black. We're down in Daytona Beach with our 1970 Chevelle SS style convertible. Black, white top, white end. Real gentleman's uh, car. Very, very solid car underneath. Very solid. New sway bar links, new springs in the front, new shocks, new hardware on the brakes, 
new ball joints top and bottom brand new torque converter you can see the tranny is fresh all freshly done 400 turbo a little deeper pan on it to allow uh, oil changes without dropping the pan even uh, frame sections in the front are very nice the tranny cooling lines are all original and nice original brake lines going back fuel lines original and it looks nice as can be uh, underpinnings of the vehicle are very very straight very nice frame no dents no marks anywhere either side just the way it was when it was new floor pans are very straight very nice no jack marks or dents in them from being lifted through the years everything appears to be straight as can be your substructure on the floors are nice uh, no dents in them either headers of course a uh, nice set of small tube headers for a big block that's in this car giving you a lot of low end grunt a lot of torque especially with this turbo 400 tranny um, two and a half inch pipes off the uh, headers um, as new condition very very nice car so far our two and a half inch pipes are terminating into standard undercarriage style mufflers have a real nice tone to them not objectionably loud more like a stock exhaust system on the vehicle which sounded great from the factory there's no problems with that frame in the back the same as the front no marks no dents no dings uh, swing arms are nice not bent or stressed torsionally in any way tailpipes are two and a quarter inch coming out of the mufflers which as you see the whole system is brand new um, new u-joints on the drive shaft front and rear drum brakes in the uh, rear as it should be new shocks brand spanking new gas tank in the back end of this car again on the frame sections in the rear there's no marks no dents no pulls very very straight looking car underneath guys there's nothing wrong under here